This is my June birch box. You're probably going, well, but it's July. Yes, this box had a trip across the country. First it came to me, but it tried to be delivered to my work address on a Saturday, which were closed. So then instead of re-delivering it on Monday, like they normally do, it got rerouted to California. So then I had to track it down through the post office. They were able to track it down and send it to me. Now, I don't know if this was my box or the ladies that got it, because I think she actually is a subscriber also. And the box I got back had her name on it, so I don't know if the other box also had her name on it or if she kept mine because she liked it better or because it was opened. So I don't know, but here is what I got because I don't believe I took any of the... Because you get a choice when it um, comes out. You can choose one of the products or the whole box or whatever. And this last month, I know I didn't choose anything. And now this birch box is usually $10 a month, but I have a yearly subscription, so it comes out to like $8.75 or something like that. So let's see what I got in my box. Now, one thing I like about birch box is it gives you a list of all the different items that are in there. So if you're ever wondering what it does or what you're supposed to do with it, it tells you, which is a very nice thing to have. So the first thing I got is a New Moisture Instant Fix Numa Protection. Now, let's see. This is a leave-in spray, which I like getting these. I have short, naturally curly hair that frizzes, so I like to use this with a gel, some type of leave-in conditioner with a gel. So I'm excited to give that a go. The next thing is, looks like some kind of lip product. Can I even tell what it is? It's New York. Nothing, oh wait, here, yeah. Liquid lip paint. Not really fond of liquid lip stuff. It usually dries out, and this looks a little dark for me. Um, this is a deep berry shade. I am white, as white as white, and I don't like dark colors like this. It just highlights my yellow teeth, and so I don't like it. So this will probably go in my giveaway pile. I won't even open it because I want to put it in my giveaway pile. This is Mana Eye Candy Priming Shadow Stick. So, two-in-one shadow stick in a summery slate shade. Glides on and stays all day thanks to built-in primer. Now, I normally don't put, um, and I'm not going to even open this. Um, it looks like a good shade. It looks like it's slightly maybe melted on the travels because it's really hot here in Nebraska. <laughs> um, I live in Lincoln, Nebraska, and it's really hot here right now. So, it looks a little melty. As you can see it's angled at a certain odd angle. I think I'll probably be putting this in my giveaway. I have dry eye syndrome, so I usually don't use anything on my eye lids. So this is a blush duo. I also don't use blush. I have naturally red tints to my cheeks, so I just put a little powder on usually, um, face powder and let my natural blush come through. So, this one is not a good box for me. Um, now, it is matching the card, so I don't think she exchanged it for anything. But this is Balance Me Instant Lift Primer. I do like to use primers on my face, um, beneath my powder, especially in the summertime. But, um, so I will definitely be giving this a try. So, this was not a good box for me. Um, Three of them will be going in my giveaway pile, and then the other two I'll be keeping. Now, I have hit 50 subscribers. In a short while, I'm going to wait and make sure I stay at 50. And if I can get more, that'd be great. But I said that when I got to 50 subscribers, I would do a giveaway. So I'm trying to work out the logistics of that, but these things might be in that giveaway. So please 
share, like, comment, subscribe if you're not already. And did you get a birch box? If so, what did you get in your birch box? And we'll catch you next time, which will be probably in a week or two because I got noticed already that my box is on its way. So thanks for everyone's support.